Okay, we're gonna give him a double. That went reasonably well. Oh, we got more. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are picking up right where we left off. Uh, as before, it's only been a couple of seconds, actually, since I left in the last episode. It just turned morning to two. Uh, so if you haven't caught those last uh, two, three episodes... We are working our way up through the Deshong Tower here in Alpha 20. My first time going through this tower in Alpha 20. And, uh, yeah, just having a good time getting uh, our butt handed to us, but still surviving so far. We haven't died, and we've had a couple of uh, pucker moments for sure. Uh, so if you guys find yourself enjoying this video, uh, please take a moment to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have subscribed, thank you very much. It means a lot. Really appreciate it. Let's get started here. Okay, so one of the things Fun Pimps did, uh, changes that they made, is they they no longer number the floors in the stairwell. So I have I I don't know what floor I'm on. <laughs> we're we're up a ways. The the floor we did in the last episode was the the night club floor. Uh, so now it looks like we're back uh, on a construction floor here. So let's start working our way through here and keep aiming towards the top. We got a little shoe pile here with some goth boots. I am infected, but I only have one antibiotic. I have no honey with me. Uh, well, I don't think we do. Did we loot any honey by chance? No, I don't think so. We got, we had some beer and stuff, but not honey. So we're um, we're doing okay on weight, though. So I'm just kind of holding off on taking that antibiotic till, you know, till a little bit later on. I don't even have any honey or antibiotics back at our base. So, um, you know, we're just being a little. My oh, senses have oh, picked shit. up something. Uh, being a little more conservative with that. All right. How many Zeeks are we talking about here? One, two, three. One? Arlene. Sledgehammer sandwich for you, my dear. Ugh. Never mind. You're not my dear. <laughs> okay. More friends. Just you? Okay. Okay. You never quite can tell if if it, if it's going to send two after you or 20. <laughs> we did have, uh, it wasn't 20, but man, we had a crap ton of Zeke's ambush us back down in the nightclub in the last episode. I was a little concerned for a while there, we'll put it that way. Okay, let's keep on moving through here. So it looks like we have another construction floor. And uh, at some point, I very likely will come back. And, uh, is that door something we, oh yeah, it's just that door. Uh, I will come back and get, at least get the the cement and probably even the clay too, because clay is actually not quite as easy to come by in Undead Legacy as it is in vanilla. You don't get as much when you dig it like you would in vanilla. It looks like I can't get to anything from that side. So let's come into here, take a look up at the ceiling. See if something's going to jump down on our face. Construction box. With some useful stuff in it. Okay. Let's move in through here. There's a lootable toolbox. Oh, rats, I was hoping we'd get a repair kit. And some plumbing for a toity, maybe? Or a hot water heater or something? I don't know. Not sure. We're going to have to repair our sledgehammer here pretty quickly. All right, grab that stuff. Yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the, the Deshong adventure. I, I sure are having fun. I, I've always enjoyed going through this place. Um, and even more so, you know, now that we see the changes. Most of the changes I really like. The two things I don't like are no water in the swimming pool. And, wait, we're not supposed to be getting that right now. I, well, you know, it's not like we can't do it. but And, you know, not numbering the stairwell so you don't know what floor you're on anymore. Am 
Might as well grab that cloth. Okay, so this is the stairwell here. I want to say this used to be the room where the floor collapsed, but it, I haven't seen any collapsing floors at all yet in the in here. I wonder if the fun pimps decided to do away with the whole collapsing floor business, which I think started in Alpha 16, if I remember right. All right, well, there doesn't appear to be... What is this? It's just... I guess it's supposed to be drywall, maybe? Anything up here? Yeah, there is a little thingy up here. A little brass action. Okay, let's go this way. Nothing back there. I feel an ambush coming on. I've got a bad feeling about this. Just just him? Stand up. Have some dignity. Even though you're dead. I wish one of these dudes would drop some honey or something. Oh, nice. We'll scrap that. Get some research data. Okay, so it looks like we're maybe on the first floor. Yeah, the first floor where it starts to crumble. And so we have one, two, three. Three, four. We have at least four more floors to go, it looks like. And I think this building has 13 stories, right? So if that's true, then we're on floor nine at the moment. Okay, let's go this way. I thought I saw something clip through that wall there. Something as in a zombie arm. My it, senses have picked up something. I was just going to say it's it's quiet. It's too quiet. Just you, dog? Okay. Item needs repairing. Uh, we'll finish them off with our sword. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Let's repair our sledge. Um, let's also, let's see, I don't want to eat any of that canned food because we can use it for recipes here. Let's eat these two things. Let's eat the yucca, or drink the yucca. We'll scrap all this brass. Okay. And all right, we're we're in decent shape. I'm gonna let my food go back down a little bit before we eat the meats too. So because we can get 50 out of there. So when it gets down to close to 100, if I'm paying attention, which you know that's a big if for me. Uh, but if I'm thinking about it, uh, we'll take the meats too at that point. Let's continue on here. Ooh, there's a friend. Okay. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Took care of them. Got some boards. 
Some boards and some lag. Oh, look at that. Can we actually get around the corner and pop him before he wakes up? That is the question. Oh, crap. We got this. More ceiling shenanigans, man. Hey, do you have any All more, systems go. How more may I help? meds in your inventory? You don't. I was wondering why she's not healing me. Let's give her. Ha uh, well, we'll give her three more. Oh well, okay. <laughs> she's healing now. It just occurred to me she hasn't been healing me lately. Let's go this way. Lots of construction boxes up here, which is nice. We're not really getting anything too terribly fantastic from them, though. Little glue action. Okay, so it looks like that's where the game wants us to go. Whoops, what am I doing? Break this. To get up to the next floor. There are two charges in there. Beautiful. Um, let's drink both of these normal waters. Excellent. Okay. Anything else over here? Yeah, we already went through there. Okay. We're done with this floor. The next floor. So what do we do? We get out here and parkour over to that ladder. And go up to here. Yeah, we're getting close, you guys. We are getting close. And we do have, indeed, have four more floors. Get up. That's not good. Oh, unbelievable. All right. Oh, uh, let's take that. Son of a beech nut. Really? Okay, I'm just going to... Can't even get up there. Really? All right, here. There we go. Hmm. Let's go this way. I don't know if that ladder will cause me problems when I try and jump up. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to put you there. Get back on the ladder. Pick that up. Ugh. Now, in case I screw this up again, we're going to give ourselves a little safety net. We're going to go all the way to the top and then step down here. Let me help you with that injury. Okay. We're good. We are on Shit's Law floor. All right. So Shit's Law is still in the building. Some more offices to go through. Sometimes there's a Zeke behind this desk, maybe. Or not. Okay. Anything around this way? I 
This is like a break room. Alright, not a whole lot in those thingies. Oh yeah, I remember this room. Um, I don't think we get ambushed in here, but I don't remember. And it could have changed from before anyway. So, oh, okay. Never mind. Alright, how many are we dealing with here? A couple three anyway. Roberta, you're kind of in the line of fire there, my dear. Conk. I like conks. Well, as long as they're not happening to me. Okay. That gets us through here. And we got some bookshelves. Nice. Dollar dollar bills. I'd rather have research, research papers, books, and that kind of thing. You look Let me help you. All right, that's a lot. Stay down. You too. And we have a sprained arm again. Hallelujah. All right, back to using the shotgun for a while. Oh, that's a nice find. Well, the game provided more shotgun shells for us. <laughs> so, you know, silver lines and all that, right? Um, Let's take one of these. My senses have picked up something. Have they? Okay, let's take the meat stew, too, because we're getting close on, the, on that. And also, um, it'll give us a little more healing, too. Come on, dummy. You gonna stay stuck in a cubicle? All right, anything lootable over here? All righty then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. You got a bunged up leg and a bunged up arm. Oh. Yikes. Any buzzards out here? Oh, shit. <laughs> I saw Roberta coming towards us and I just instinctively... Uh, I don't think we could fall through here, but let's not take any chances. We're going to jump up there. Oh. Sniper doodle shot. All right, is that just a corpse? I can't tell. Yeah, I think it is. Okay, there's another businessman there, and we got a pretty clear headshot. Beautiful. More sniper opportunities. Not that I can see from here. Okay. Nope. Can't use a sledgehammer. Not with her bad arm. Come on, gang. Give me some honey, man. Oh, you know what? I think we're past. 10%. Oh, man, I should have paid attention to that. Well, that's okay. We'll at least, um, dang it, <laughs> for 0.1% over the, the limit there. Well, at least we'll we'll slow it down for a while until we come up with a better solution. I waited just a little too long. Oh, well.
I'm going to take one of these. We got several of those. And let's pop uh, a mineral water to counter that. All right, none of that stuff's lootable. Can't sprint. Any wall safes or anything like that in here? Does not look like it. Okay, let's walk over here. We haven't really been messing with the stairwell, but we'll worry about that later, I suppose. Okay, there's a ramp up to the next floor. Let's head over here first, though. Couple bookshelves. Beautiful. SMG auto turret. Let's learn it. We might want to use that at some point. Pumpkin bread. Yep. Beautiful. Both of those were pretty nice. Oh, don't run. It's a habit. Okay, up to the next level. Three floors to go. I think, is this the medical floor? I think this is the medical floor. No, I guess it's another office floor, and then, we, then we'll have a medical floor. Well, that's rude. Nice. A little bit of spam action there for some sham, or sham action rather, for some sham chowder later on. Oh, I keep forgetting. I'm not supposed to be using my sledgehammer. We have seven minutes on that damn thing. Do I have any health, uh, health candy thingies? I do not. Uh, all right. Ah, nice. Another working vending machine with some health bars. Okay, let's buy both of those. We want the eye candy. We want the hackers. Chicken ration. Nah, we don't need that. We can't use that in recipe. I got plenty of food. We want that. Covert cats, nerd tats, uh, sugar butts, peas, atoms. Cats, nerd tats, and beer. Um, uh, we got 17 jailbreakers. I don't think we need to buy any more jailbreakers. Okay, I think that's all we're going to do. We're good. No charges in the coffee machine. That door's locked. We could, uh, we'll eat those just to top off our food. That's scary. All right, let's um. Okay, we're gonna give him a double. That went reasonably well. Oh, we got more. Do we have more? Oh, look at you. You're being dumb.
Oh, that desk is locked. Is that a... That's a thing? Why do I not remember desks being locked before? That... Even There's a small chance that we might mess around with this in the late game. Yeah, what the hell? Let's it, it's a pretty rare item too, so let's let's learn it. For that reason alone, if nothing else, right? Uh, all right, let's unlock this desk. Why have I not noticed locked desk before? There we go. A little more down. And one more bump. <laughs> and that's all it's got in it. Oh, for goodness sakes. Okay. A couple charges in here. Beautiful. It's just on the floor there. Yeah, I honestly don't remember desks being locked before. Maybe they have, and I just don't remember. More bookshelves. What is that? Power sliding gate. Again, we're going to learn that just because you never know. Oh, here we go. Targets with three meters, within three meters, have a high dismemberment chance. Beautiful. Scrap that and take that. More research data, baby. All right. Beautiful. Absolutely marvelous. Yeah, regarding the locked desks, you know, sometimes us YouTubers, especially those of us who have been playing a certain game for a very long time. I mean, I've got... Over 4,000 hours in this game. You know, we come across, we still sometimes come across things that, we, you know, for whatever reason, we just never knew. And it's very difficult to know every possible thing that could potentially be known in the games, especially with changes and especially with mods, because mods really change things up. But sometimes, you know, viewers will leave comments and say, how could you not know that when you've been playing this game for so long? Well... It's just, you know, you can't always know everything all the time. That's that's my answer to that. Old man sat. My senses oh, have shit. picked up something. Down with the sickness. Any charges? There's one charge. Yeah, I don't think anybody knows everything. They might say they do or think they do, but... I mean, it's possible, of course, but it's not likely. Uh, were we supposed to go in there? Oh, yeah, you know what? I think we were, but we got ambushed and then didn't do it. Is there a reason to go in here? There's a desk. Oh, yeah, there's an uh, a munitions crate. All right, what's going to be the quickest way to break through here as opposed to going all the way back around? Actually, here, this this is going to be the quickest way. Don't run. No running allowed. Come on. Look at that. A pink... Oh, no, it's a red munitions box. What does that mean exactly? Nothing. We just get the normal stuff. <laughs> it's red. That's what it means. Ah, that's a reason to come in here. And we got a medical pile, too. How about some antibiotics? Nope. No antibiotics. Okay, let's open this thing up. We're probably going to need a candy for this one, right? Nope. Yeah. Uh, yep, yep. I said yep. You guys thought I said nope. I actually said yep. The second time. All right, give us something good, man. Give us something good. We're going to save our eye candy for the fat loots at the top, of course. All right. Do we need to go down or back up a little? Oh, 
Okay, scrap that, and we have a higher quality pocket mod. So, let's see. What are you? You got a cargo. You got a pocket. Modify. I guess 5.3, this gives 2.8. So, yeah, it's a little bit of an improvement. Is there anything else that we could put the pocket mod on? All this stuff is armor. You got cargo. Yeah, okay. So we actually don't need this um, anymore. Maybe we'll put it on some clothing and sell it if we have a high level item or something like that. Okay, that is it. Yeah, we're not breaking through there. Let's go back. Okay, we are back. Uh, to where we left off, we got a ammo pile in that room. I do see a business guy through the window there. I'm not seeing anybody in that room. That doesn't mean there's nobody there, though. Incoming enemies. Prepare for conflict. Yeah, okay. Oh, no. Don't use a sledge. Takes care of them. Another bookshelf. Uh, full auto trigger mod. Yeah, let's learn it. I like that mod. We might want to make it at some point. Nothing behind there. We'll grab this and grab this. Grab that. More books. We'll take them. Oh, shut up. <laughs> you whiner. Okay. Now, this is the next part. Uh, we're going to have a little parkour going on here. And considering the state of my leg, I might not do that and just go back to the stairwell. Shotguns. Okay. Let's see, what do we have to do here? Uh, let's just check it out. Um, one, two, three. So, so let's tell through more floors. Okay. Oh, that's all we got to do? Okay. Oh, they must have changed that because I thought you had to do... A little bit of fancy footwork to get up to this next level, but maybe not. Nothing in there. We just we was just in there. Okay, now we're on the medical floor. All right, guys. Well, um, I think it's time for us to wrap up this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, as usual, we'll just pick up right where we left off. Uh, we are still doing fine on ammo. We got plenty of ammo. Uh, meds are getting kind of low, but we also have the painkiller, so I think we're okay there. We got plenty of food and stuff to drink, and we are getting right on the verge of running out of room. But I mean, worst case scenario, I can always go back down through the stairwell uh, to offload back on the bike, or we could even stash some things if we have to, uh, because you know I don't want to quit now. Let's just let's just keep moving until until we're done here. Uh, I can make this? No, that's the research for that. Okay. Uh, yeah, so with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, make sure you hit that like button and leave a comment to share out the video. And I'm just completely screwed up my outro, but you, you know how it goes, right? Uh, appreciate you guys. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.